Good day kids. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today our lesson is about addition and subtraction of fractions using LCD method. First, what is the LCD? It is the abbreviation of lowest common denominator. It is the lowest common multiple of the denominators of a set of fractions. To add or subtract fractions with different denominators, we need to do some extra steps. We will go over a few examples in this lesson to make sure you get comfortable with the procedure. Here are the steps how to add or subtract fractions with different denominators using LCD method. Given two unlike fractions 1 half plus 1 fourth. Make the denominators the same by finding the least common multiple or LCM of their denominators. This step is exactly the same as finding the least common denominator or LCD. Let's start with the highest denominator. The list of multiples for 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20 and so on. The list of multiples for 2 are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 and so on. The common multiples of 2 and 4 are 4, 8 and 12. Among these three, the least common multiple is 4. To know more about LCM and the other way of getting it, you can check my other video about this. Now, back to what we are solving. Use the LCM to make like fractions. Divide the LCM to the denominator and multiply the answer by the numerator. 4 divided by 2 is 2. 2 times 1 is 2. 4 divided by 4 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. The result will be the new numerators, and the denominators will be the LCM. The LCM is now your LCD. Then add 2 fourth plus 1 fourth is 3 fourth. Next example 3 fourth plus 1 twelfth. Just like before, we have to get the LCM of the given denominators. The multiples of 12 are 12, 24, 36, and more. The multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, and so on. The LCM of 4 and 12 is 12. We can also easily spot the LCM of the given denominators by dividing the biggest number with smaller numbers. Like for example, 12 divided by 4 is 3. If the remainder of your answer is zero, or no remainder at all, therefore, the LCM of the given denominators is the biggest denominator which is 12. Now, let's use this LCM to make like fractions. Divide the LCM to the denominator and multiply the answer by the numerator. 12 divided by 4 is 3. 3 times 3 is 9. 12 divided by 12 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. The LCM is now our LCD. Then add. 9 plus 1 is 10. Remember, always reduce the answer to its lowest terms. Thus, the final answer is 5 6. Another. Let's add 3 unlike fractions. 1 half plus 3 16th plus 1 fourth. Before we list the multiples of 2, 4, and 16, let's do some division first. Divide the highest denominator 16 by 2 and 4. 16 divided by 2 is 8, and 16 divided by 4 is 4. If the remainder of both answer is 0, or no remainder at all, then the LCM of 2, 4, and 16 is 16, the highest denominator. However, if one of them got one or more as a remainder, then, we can't take the highest denominator as our LCM. Example, 16 divided by 8 is 2, then the other is, 16 divided 5 is 3 remainder 1. In this case, 16 is not the LCM of the given denominators. Now going back, let's rewrite our fractions using this LCM, then add.
As a result, the answer is 15 16 One more example. This time we will add mixed number with different denominators. 3 and 3 fifth plus 2 and 1 half. Again, let's try to divide the highest denominator 5 by 2. If the remainder is not equal to 0, therefore we shall need to list the multiples of 2 and 5 to get the LCM. The multiples of 5 are 5, 10, 15, and more. The multiples of 2 are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, and so on. In listing the multiples of the given numbers, the first common multiple that we see is also our LCM. The LCM as well as the LCD of 2 and 5 is 10. Now, let's use this LCM to make like fractions. Copy first the whole numbers, then divide the LCM to the denominator and multiply the answer by the numerator. Add them. If the fraction is improper, change it to mixed number. Add the whole numbers together. And simplify the fraction if needed, then copy. The final answer is 6 and 1 tenth. Now let's subtract unlike fractions by finding the LCD. Subtract 3 seventh minus 5 fourteenth. To solve for LCM of the denominators, let's try to divide first the highest denominator and see if the remainder is 0. If not, then we will proceed on listing their multiples. 14 divided by 7 is 2. Therefore, the LCM of 7 and 14 is 14. Use the LCM to make like fractions. Divide the LCM to the denominator and multiply the answer by the numerator. 14 divided by 7 is 2. 2 times 3 is 6. 14 divided by 14 is 1. 1 times 5 is 5. The result will be the new numerators, and the denominators will be the LCM. The LCM is now your LCD. Then subtract. 6 minus 5 is 1. As a result, the difference of 3 7 minus 5 14 is 1 14. Another is getting the difference of mixed numbers. 7 and 1 half minus 3 and 1 fourth. Make like fractions by finding the LCM of the denominators. The LCM or LCD of 2 and 4 is 4. Now, let's use this LCM to make like fractions. Copy first the whole numbers, then divide the LCM to the denominator and multiply the answer by the numerator. Before we proceed to the next step, make sure that the first fraction is enough that we can subtract the next one. If so, then we can continue. For whole numbers 7 minus 3 is 4 and 2 fourth minus 1 fourth is 1 fourth. Therefore, the answer is 4 and 1 fourth. There you have it, I hope you've learned something today. If you like our discussion, click like and subscribe. Thank you, and see you again next time.